Welcome back everyone to Game Zone Bird Room. Game Zone. And of course it's not the Game Zone Bird Room without the birds. Hello dicks. You never do that anymore, do ya? Naughty boy. Hello Moose. Hello pretty girl. Hello pretty girl. Hello, my babies. Where's that little one? There he is. Hello, Donny. Pretty boys. What have I got for you today, guys? Well, a couple of weeks back, I was the birthday boy. And these are the things I got. First up, a gift from my missus best friend, Becky and her family, they gave me a tenner to spend for my birthday. So I went on the CEX website and found this for a tenner. Oh, I was so chuffed. Game I've been wanting to add to the collection for a fucking long time. And that is fighting fifers for the sake of Saturn. Cases isn't in the best of nick. Does need a bit of love and care, which I will give it. I will get, as you can see that, it's torn a bit. But it is complete. And the disc... It's complete, see? And the disc isn't in too bad a shape, so I'm really happy. Yeah. AM2 fighting game uh, from the same creators as Virtual Fighter. A little bit different. This is more arcade -y. You've got a wall around you which you can knock your opponent out of. And obviously, each character has like uh, armour on them which you can knock off as well. And once the armour's off, they're literally quite weak. They're characters and you can literally kick the shit out of them. Really good fighting game. So, very happy that is in the collection. Next up, we have uh, gifts from me mother-in-law and her husband, Carl. Uh, the first thing I got from them a couple of days before my actual birthday uh, was this cool little gift. A pair of socks inside a little box that looks like the original Game Boy. I think that's really cool. And it's got Space Invaders on the socks as well. Really cool that is. Uh, yeah, and also they gave me £20, which I went on to CX and bought three Dreamcast games for 20 quid, And they're, they're pretty pretty decent ones, I think. Uh, first up is a classic arcade football game. Yes, I'm talking about Virtual Striker 2. Absolute classic. Remember playing this uh, uh, Cine World in Newport on the Isle of Wight with, with one of my good friends, Joe. He's really good at football games, and I think he absolutely killed me. But yeah, fantastic game. Happy that's in the collection. Uh, next up, I've never actually played any NBA games on the Dreamcast, but yeah, this is supposed to be bloody brilliant. And that's NBA 2K. Graphics on it looks pretty awesome from the, uh, the pictures at the back. And I was surprised, all three games... None of the actual hinges are broken. Which for Dreamcast, that's fucking amazing. It's so poorly designed. And next up is an absolute classic. Played this uh, just recently on my V2 Elite console. And that is Ferrari 355 Challenge. Quality game. Absolutely stunning graphics for the time. Bloody hard as well. Don't think I've won a race yet. But yeah, look at that. Love the cover artwork as well. You can't beat a Ferrari. Beautiful cars. So yeah, thank you Mum and Carl. Really over the moon with them presents. Uh, next up, we have a couple of gifts from me, uh, me brother and me dad. Uh, I, I've added a couple of extra quid to this one as the second present pretty much took up most of that money so I, I added just a bit and yeah and that is it's a reproduction but all all games all great fighting games in one place and that's the street fighter collection for the saturn so yeah every single uh street fighter game that game that came out on the saturn is in this collection so one lovely place and they have they have all the Cases have got artwork of which game it is, so they're really nicely done. Really happy with this. They play absolutely brilliant as well. 
I love the artwork on the front, that is really cool. And yeah, the, and, and this, oh, I absolutely love. Again, for the Sega Saturn, it is the Sega Saturn arcade stick. What a beast. It's a big boy. I thought it would be heavier, but it is, it is metal at the bottom with little pads, little feet on the pads to try and stop it from slipping. So yeah, you've got your, uh, your turbo buttons that you can turn your turbos on, which is quite handy for um, shoot, shoot them ups. Yeah, arcade type of buttons, but they're not they're not proper arcade buttons. They're a bit like the uh, buttons you get on the joypad. The same as same as the arcade stick as well. It's not it's not micro switch. A little bit disappointing, but never mind. We will review this. And now I've got the Street Fighter collection. At least we've got some fighting games to test out how good this stick is. So yes, brilliant presents from me, dad and my brother. Thank you guys very much. Uh, next up we have, wait a minute, let's have a drink. Yeah, next up we have some wonderful gifts from my beautiful, wonderful wife, the Game Zone Doll Room. So we are down to the final gifts and these first three from my wonderful wife is from a shop called Hidden Chess Gaming. You might have heard of this on my channel before because it was in the 12 Streams of Christmas song that I sung so beautifully. Uh, yeah, this, this is a shop run by the legend that is Danester and his friend, I can't remember your name, I do apologise. But Danester done a terrific deal to my wife on three great games. And the first one is a legendary fighting series, Tekken, Tekken 2, in a weird, Sort of done in sort of a Sega Saturn two disc uh, case. Yeah, quite strange. But yeah, Tekken two, all complete, all in nice, nice condition. So yeah, really happy with that. And the sequel, should I say, the third sequel, Tekken three. What a beautiful game this was when this came originally came out for the uh, PS one. Great looking game, great fighting game as well. PS1 had uh, Tekken, Sega Saturn had Virtual Fighter, two fantastic fighting series. And last but not least, one of the greatest driving games of all time, and that is Gran Turismo 2 for the PlayStation 1. Again, another quality looking title, great graphics for the time. So yeah, thank you Dane Star, thank you for doing my wife a wonderful deal. Uh, thank you baby, three great games. Uh, next up we have three reproduction games from the wife. Uh, first one is Alone in the Dark, uh, Jack is back. I have played this now, I've played this for about half an hour and uh, yeah, it's not that great. This game goes for about 20, 30 quid, so I'm glad she, yeah, the wife got a reproduction of it. But it's an important game. It was the first um, sort of survival horror series, and you know, it inspired Resident Evil. So it is an important game, so I'm glad it's in the collection. And so, yeah, I will be playing more of this. <laughs> Graphics are terrible. <laughs> but I remember looking at it in the old magazines back in the day, I think it looked absolutely brilliant, especially the green zombies. I thought, oh, this this game looks awesome. So yeah, I, again, as I said, I'm happy to see the collection. And yeah, what a wonderful gift this was. The missus originally had this game back in the day, and uh, it's worth about five, six hundred quid now. And yeah, and that is. Panzer Dragon, and this is the complete collection. It's got one, two, and three. It is another reproduction. Love the artwork on this. Really, really nice. But yeah, I've only just started playing uh, Saga and sort of enjoying it. I'm not a massive lover of the uh, RPG games, and uh, but I'm enjoying this. 
that sort of sense of freedom as you're flying on a massive dragon is yeah really really cool game and the third reproduction if i can grab it that's it you fat bastard and yeah and the third reproduction is a game that's quite pricey now for the dreamcast and it's another beat em up because i love my beat em ups it's another classic street fighter 3 third strike so yeah looking forward to playing this quite a nice big roster of characters I think there's about 18, 19 of them on here. But who doesn't like a bit of Street Fighter? So we are down to the last few bits now. Uh, a nice comic she bought me. Uh, it's, a new, it's a new collection Marvel's doing. I probably won't collect the rest because I think they go up to about eight ninety nine in price. But this, this is the first first uh, issue and they always do it very cheap don't they 199 so yeah pretty cool I do love my uh, Marvel graphic novels Mr. always goes oh they're just comic books no they're graphic novels it's like oh yeah yeah, yeah you're toys aren't they no they're action figures they're not toys they're action figures Comics or graphic novels. Uh, yeah, next up, classic, classic fighting game on a SNES, and that is the legendary Mortal Kombat 2. Probably one of the best versions of Mortal Kombat 2 on any console. Really, really good. And obviously, it also adds blood. Blood was not in the first game, but Nintendo made sure. It was in the second. And last but not least, well, no, second to last, are two Saturn games. The first one is a Japanese, and it's bloody sealed. Can you believe that? Dylan, Hyper Trigger Rex, you would be happy. You would be very happy with this. It's sealed. And it's not going to be sealed for, for much longer, because I want to play it. I love playing my games. Uh, yeah, and that is uh, Kings the Spirit racing game up a massive mountain really really good game I want to get the second one now I've seen reviews for the second one and the graphics on it looks fucking amazing for a Saturn game and yeah last but definitely not least we have big massive robots fighting it out on a Sega Saturn yes I'm talking about virtual one absolute classic game this is part of my uh, games I want for my Sega Saturn discs and it was one of the games I wanted to, wanted to get and yeah it was £20, uh, yeah, £20 from CEX so I was quite happy with that and it's in really nice condition as well the disc is like, like new almost and the manual looks really good as well oh not now but yeah, the manual's in lovely condition as well. So, yeah. What a birthday. What a birthday. Some absolutely brilliant gifts. So, thank you. Thank you to my family. Um, my mum and Carl. And Becky and your family. And obviously to my wonderful wife. I was absolutely spoiled rotten. Anyway, guys. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Button bash that like. Hit the subscribe button. Hit that little bell. Take it easy. Game zone.